ethics let review prepared by Melanie Sal. Question number one. Who among the following proposed that feelings serves as obstructions to our discernment of right and wrong? A. Augustine B. Socrates C. Immanuel Kant or D. Thomas Aquinas The correct answer is C. Immanuel Kant Question number two. There are three natures of man according to Plato, except A. Rational or mental B. Physical or emotional C. Vegetables or physical or D. Animal or emotional The correct answer is B. Physical or emotional Question number 3. What are the three general subjects areas of morality? A. Metaethics, Normative Ethics, Microethics B. Normative Ethics, Metaethics, Applied Ethics C. Moral Ethics, Applied Ethics, Metaethics Or D. Metaethics, Microethics, or Applied Ethics The correct answer is B. Normative Ethics, Metaethics, Applied Ethics Question number 4. Which of the following philosophers asserts that those who comprehend the good will always do good actions? A. Augustine B. Aristotle C. Socrates or D. Plato The correct answer is D. Plato. Question number 5. What phenomena best describes the growing interdependence of the world's population, cultures, and economies? A. Industrialization B. Socialization C. Globalization or D. All of the above The correct answer is C. Globalization. Question number 6. Which group is considered as the first global-centric generation having come of age during the rapid growth of the internet and an increase in global terrorism? A. Millennials B. Gen Z C. Generation X or D. Gen Alpha The correct answer is B. Gen Z. Question number 7. What form of cognitive ethics claims that existence of moral facts and the truth or falsity of moral judgments are independent of people's thoughts and proportions? A. Moral realism B. Emotivism C. Ethical realism or D. Ethical Subjectivism The correct answer is A. Moral Realism Question number 8 It is a meta-ethical stance which states that moral facts are known through observation and experience A. Moral Relativism B. Moral Rationalism C. Moral Empiricism or D. Moral Intuitionism The correct answer is C. Moral Empiricism Question number 9. Whose philosophy does love is the active center of our moral life as love moves us where it desires came from? A. Augustine B. Thomas Aquinas, C. Immanuel Kant, or D. Socrates? The correct answer is A. Augustine. 
Question number 10. Which among the following is the basis in making ethically sensitive decision? A. Ethical dilemma B. Ethical standards C. Ethical sensitivity or D. Ethical decision making The correct answer is D. Ethical decision making Question number 11 Giving each person what he or she deserves. What word best represents this? A. Equality B. Fairness C. Justice or D. Freedom The correct answer is C. Justice Question number 12. What can globalization lead to? A. Increase global cooperation and global conflict. B. Economic and financial changes. C. Bribery and corruption. Or D. Exploitation and job displacement. The correct answer is C. Bribery and corruption. Question number 30. The following are ways in coping ethical challenges except A. Suggest an alternative B. Ask questions C. Live if necessary or D. Restrain oneself The correct answer is D. Restrain oneself Question number 14 which refers to events, situations, and broader social forces affecting everyone. A. Period B. Life cycle or age C. Cohort or D. Social influence The correct answer is A. Period Question number 15 what branch of philosophy that deals with the human actions and reasons for action? A. Behavioral psychology B. Moral philosophy C. Ethics or D. Epistemology The correct answer is C. Ethics Question number 16 which of the following theory denies that moral judgments are either true or false? A. Cognitivism B. Non-cognitivism C. Universalism or D. Relativism The correct answer is B. Non-cognitivism Question number 17 According to Augustine, happiness is equated with achievement of A. Wisdom B. Justice C. Desire or D. Enlightenment The correct answer is A. Wisdom Question number 18 what branch of ethics evaluates the standards for the rightness and wrongness of actions and determines a moral cause of action? A. Moral ethics B. Normative ethics C. Applied ethics or D. Virtue ethics The correct answer is B. Normative ethics Question number 19. For a subject to be considered as an applied ethical issue, not only must it be a matter of moral judgment, but also it has to be A. Arguable B. Relevant C. Timely or D. Controversial The correct answer is D. Controversial Question number 20. What condition limits or permits ethical or unethical behavior? A. Dilemma 
B. Opportunity C. Ethical decision making or D. Standards The correct answer is B. Opportunity Question number 21 Whose theory is justice as fairness which recommends equal basis rights, equality of opportunity, and promoting the interests of the least advantaged members of society. A. John Raleigh B. John Ramsey C. John Ray or D. John Rawls The correct answer is D. John Rawls Question number 22 what are the two principles of social justice? A. Corrective principle and equity principle B. Liberty of principle and equity principle C. Liberty of principle and equality principle or D. Corrective principle and equality principle The correct answer is C. Liberty of Principle and Equality Principle Question number 23 Generation X are people born in what year? A. 1980 to 1995 B. 1965 to 1979 C. 1962 to 1977 or D. 1971 to 1995 The correct answer is B, 1965 to 1979. Question number 24. The ultimate human goal according to Aristotle is A, self-actualization, B, happiness, C, self-realization, or D, enlightenment. The correct answer is A. Self-actualization Question number 25 Who is this philosopher who believes that happiness is not equated with pleasure, material possessions, honor, or any sensual good but consists of activities in accordance with virtue? A. Aristotle B. Thomas Aquinas C. Immanuel Kant or D. Moral Ethics? The correct answer is B. Thomas Aquinas. Question number 26. What branch of ethics explains what goodness and weakness mean and how we know about them? A. Meta Ethics, B. Applied Ethics, C. Normative Ethics, or D. Moral Ethics? The correct answer is A. Metaethics. Question number 27. It is usually dictated by our moral system. What do we call this concept? A. Freedom B. Justice C. Fairness or D. Equality The correct answer is C. Fairness. Question number 28. Which generation declares higher priority for work over personal life? A. Millennials B. Generation X C. The Silent Generation or D. Baby Boomer The correct answer is D. Baby Boomer Question number 29 Which best describes equality? A. Giving everyone the same thing. B. Giving access to same opportunity. C. Making everyone feel loved and included. Or D. Treating everyone fairly regardless of race, gender, nationality, ability, or disability. The correct answer is A. Giving everyone the same thing. Question number 30. 
From what age group does the selfie generation and followers of social media belongs to? A. Millennials B. Gen Alpha C. Gen Z or D. Millennials. The correct answer is D. Millennials.